Doctor Who fans can expect a darker, more enigmatic version of the Time Lord, according to the latest incarnation of the science fiction hero, Peter Capaldi. The actor attended the screening of the first episode in Cardiff today, along with thousands of fans. He'll be the 12th Doctor to grace our television screens when the series returns later this month, as Lizo Mazimba reports. The kind of crowds usually reserved for a Hollywood blockbuster, an overwhelming amount of expectation for the new Doctor. It's quite scary because obviously it's so loved by people and it is an iconic figure and it's, it's, it, it is important to people and you feel a great responsibility. Glad to be my pal. Tell me, am I a good man? A character of contrasts, Capaldi's Time Lord definitely has a little less light and a little more shade. Don't know. I was keen that he would be um, uh, a little uh, darker, less user friendly. Uh, but he's funny, you know, he's still very joy, he's a very joyful character. Okay, this is Clara, not my assistant, she's uh, some other word. I'm his carer. Yeah, my carer, she cares so I don't have to. Your predecessor, Matt, was the youngest yeah. ever Doctor, your equal eldest with uh, William Hartnell. <laughs> Part of you must worry that uh, a more elderly Doctor might have trouble hanging on to the younger end of uh, what's essentially a kid show. Uh, I don't think so. I think um, there's, a, there's a magic about him that is not about being in your 20s or in your 30s. There's, you know, we don't you know, consider the Wizard of Oz to be too old, or we don't consider Father Christmas to be or to be too old. You know, these are these are these are mythical, magical characters. Doctor. One of TV's most successful dramas, the BBC's hoping that will continue with the twelfth Doctor taking the show into its sixth decade. A Dalek so damaged it's turned good. Morality is malfunction. Lisa Mazimba, BBC News, Cardiff. How do I resist?